Welcome to our 10-minute morning routine for your health, our waking up routine. We're working a lot from home right now, sitting mostly, so exercising as much as possible is important and helps you to get your day started. Let's get to it right away. The best thing would be if you were to do this daily. It'll do you a world of good. Sit on the mat like this, with your legs apart by 90 degrees, maybe a bit more, and try and reach your feet. Maybe your feet have to be closer to your upper body or further down to generate a stretch in your lower back. And then simply try to pull yourself forward so that tension here can disappear. Pull yourself forward, get a feel for it. Try it out. Left or right side. Wherever the stretch is stronger. If you think you could take on more, then do it and move your butt back a little more. And the stretch in your lower back will get stronger because this is where the back extensor muscles are still tight from last night. Because at night, they typically want to recover from all the abuse they had to endure during the day. And that's why it's so good to greet them with a good morning. Let's get moving again. Free yourselves. Expand, stretch out, get more flexible, go to the left and go to the right, but always going forward and try and get that bend going in your lower back, maybe even move your butt further back, use your breathing. Breathing out calmly means that your muscles are yielding a bit more and slowly get up and enjoy this relaxed feeling in your lower back. Straighten your left leg and prop up the right one. And leave your back absolutely straight and pull yourself carefully forward until you feel a rather unpleasant stretch in the hollow of your knee. But always stay under 10 on your personal pain scale. You know 10 means that you have to muscle guard to be able to bear the pain physically or mentally, and we don't want that. We want to stay below 10. And continue to pull yourself forward. Put your right leg across your left one, and at the same time, pull your torso forward and your knee to your chest. The stretch should be felt in the back of your left leg and your right buttock. Posterior left leg and in your right buttock. And dial the stretch up to under 10. And then, with your left hand, reach across your head and pull your head to the left so that you get a stretch started in the right side of your neck. So we have three nice stretches going. And slowly leave this position. And now you're going to stretch your right leg and prop up the left one. Try to arch your back as much as you can and then pull yourself forward in this position. You want to feel the stretch in the back of your leg. Breathe into the stretch. Breathe into the stretch. You're stretching the back of your right leg, activating your arms to get ready for the day. And then put your left foot across your right leg, so you could pull your left knee to your chest. The right side of your chest. And feel the stretch developing in your left buttock. Feel what's happening in your left buttock. Take both stretches to slightly below 10. And use your right arm to pull your head to the right and down. Now the stretch is in the back of your right leg, the left buttock, 
Try to optimize the position. Pull your head to the right. And now slowly leave this position. Straighten your left leg and bring your right leg behind you. And try to get your butt as closely to your right foot as possible. If you can't do it, don't worry. If you can, try and touch your foot. And then move your torso back, supported by your left and right arm, and move backwards in a way that makes the stretch as intense, 9.5 maybe, as intense as the stretch you get in your left shoulder when you move your hand further back. So stretch here, and at the same time, open up your shoulder, which also needs it. Because all those hours of sitting at the desk are still in your chest, and we're pulling that open now, stretching it here, and at the same time, we stretch our left shoulder. And slide back with your hand so that you could still bear the stretch in your arm and shoulder. Breathe nice and easy. Stretch to be prepared for the day. Then slowly leave that position and straighten your right leg and bring your left one behind you and try to get your butt as close to your heel as possible. Start the stretch and bring your arm as much back as possible. If you have shoulder problems, keep your arm more to the side. If your shoulder problems are less severe, move your hand more to the back. And while you do that, you stretch open this shoulder, this area here. Basically, we're stretching along this line from here up to there, a very long line, so that all the things that have contracted and accumulated through the entire day before and the night are getting lengthened and made flexible again. To get a good start into your day, breathe nice and easy, breathe deep in, deep breath out. Optimize the stretch. Your left arm controls the intensity of the stretch in your left thigh. Let me show you. And your right arm wants to go back even more. And you can feel an intense stretch that lengthens what has become short during the day before or even during your sleep. Many people sleep on their sides with rounded shoulders. And we're pulling that apart, nice and easy. And we slowly come out of this position. Bring your left leg forward. Normalize everything. And let's stand back up. Shake everything loose a little bit. Feels good, right? So, put your hands on your butt. And lean backwards. Breathe nice and easy. Breathe in. And on your exhale, bend over backwards, also with your head. Look at the sky if you're outdoors. If not, use your imagination. And up again. And then, with a straight back, we're bending forward. Round your back. Try to touch the floor. Get back up again and backwards, and lean to the left. Take your right arm over your head and pull with your left hand to the left, and back, and in the other direction. Pull to the right, stay in the axis, open up your left side, and up again. And now we rotate to the left as much as you can, and back again. And then rotate to the right, torso and head to the right. All right, shake it loose. So, now the day can begin. That's it. I hope it was a help. 
and you feel good, don't forget to go and check out our LNB Premium channel. More information can be found down there. To subscribe to our channel, if you haven't done so already, click down here. And all that's left to say now is stay healthy, and I'll see you soon.